Don Corleone. I am honored and grateful that you have invited me to your home. Serafina. It's been too long since you've come around. What's troubling you? Godfather. My husband was always loyal to you. He died for that loyalty. I have not forgotten him, nor the loss that you have suffered. Have you ever wanted for anything? Haven't I always taken good care of you? Padrino, forgive me. It's only that I'm so worried about my son. He's fallen in with some bad men. Fools. He's in trouble and... Please. He needs your help. Godfather. I hope that their first child be a masculine child. Thank you, Luca. My most valued friend. Don Colio, I'm gonna leave you now because I know that you are busy. Thank you. One more thing, my friend. I need you to find someone for me. Don't you deserve to cut the loot, huh? Just cause you drove the fucking car? I'm the leader of this gang, and you get what I say you get. Ah! Stay down, punk! <laughs> Check his pockets. My name is Luca Barazzi. I've been looking for you. You just stay right there. You're gonna help me teach the kid how to look after himself. Just do what he says. Basics now, let's see you use them. Okay, tough guy, your turn. Attack the kid. So, kid, you and me, got some business. Come take a walk. I've been looking for you for a while. You and me, we're gonna get real close, see? You'll need a map. Help you find your way around. Together with your notepad, you'll be able to find all the harder spots in town. <laughs> I still forget where the hell I am from time to time.
excuse me. I wish my wife could mop up. Luca's gonna meet you outside. I wouldn't keep him waiting. Hey, kid. Let's take a walk. Ah, it's less crowded now. I like that. Makes it easier for a man to get his business done. I make good money, I help the family, I get a little action on the side. But one thing must be understood. I would never go against the Godfather. <gasps> Don Corleone is a man I respect. Old Emilio. He doesn't seem to give a damn about paying us respect. He's giving his kickbacks to the Tatalias. Needs to be taught a lesson. I want you to have a word with Emilio. Convince him to pay his dues to the Corleones. Think you know what to do? Sort of. How should I handle it? Eh, it depends. With some guys, you only need to show a little respect. Just walk up to them and talk to them. A little negotiation goes a long way. Got it. And if the guy don't look like he's gonna crack? Then you remind him why he needs protection in the first place. Try turning up the pressure, but don't go too far. A man pushed past his limits can be dangerous. Capiche? Luca Brasi sent me. He has some business he wants to settle with you today. Why should I even give you a dime? Ah, how about I redecorate? No more! Listen, Emilio. The Corleones run this neighborhood. If you're not paying them, you'll pay the consequences. I don't want no trouble with you. Take the money, give Luca Brazzi my regards. Go to the devil! Notify you next to Ken, Mac? The Corleones want to make an investment in your casino. What do you say? Sure. I had a good run. Best of luck to you. You looking at me? Hey, this is my neighborhood. You and your paisan must honor me. Okay, okay. I don't want no trouble. I don't like cheapskates. But I'll take what you've got. Maybe we'll see each other around sometime, huh? Jeez. 
Jeez, what took you so long? You get the money? Yeah. Hand it over. See? I told you this business was interesting, huh? I want you to meet up with a friend of mine, Paul Gatto. Show him this. That way he'll know you're a friend of mine. I gotta go. Do you have friends in the... So rude. You look like you want to talk to me? You must be the new guy I heard about. Interested in making a little money? Hey, sure. What can I do for you? The Tatalias have been turning the screws in Little Italy lately. And now the shopkeepers are paying them instead of Why us. Why to clean up those we'll other businesses, to too? And show them who runs this town. Man, oh man, what was I thinking? The Corleones would like to ensure that your barbershop stays safe. Think you can pull that on me? You want that? Please don't hurt me. These razors are really sharp, aren't they? I'll do what you say. Just don't hurt me. I'm looking for Paul Gatto. Luca. Luca sends his love. So, you Luca's new errand boy? I ain't nobody's errand boy. Hey, take a joke, why don't you? Take it easy. Take it easy. Look, Luca told us about you. He's just, uh, busting your balls, Paulie. Right, Paulie? Thinks he's a comedian. Meet Marty Malone. He ain't a pretty sight, but, My uh... friends call me Monk. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. Okay, okay, this ain't no tea party. We got work to do. Now follow me. It's right around the corner. The Undertaker's daughter just got out of the hospital. She got beat up pretty bad by a couple of punks. We gotta off these guys. No. We're under orders. Just beat them up real bad. So keep you cool. I'll show you what to do. Don't make Luca a liar, all right? He said you wouldn't have any problem teaching these two degenerates a lesson. Baby, baby, don't some be like this. Serenade I we're just want to talk. Oh, shit. Don't let him get away. Uh, I've got money. I'll pay you. Oh, not bad. I think this kid can fight, Paulie. She's just so damn broad! I'm sorry! We were just having some fun! Well, 
well, well. Looks like there's nobody home in this one. Nah, he's down there. Maybe he can use some so company. Please, I won't do it again. Oh, we know you ain't gonna do it again. Jeez, you should have learned to treat the games a little nicer, with a little respect. Now it's too late. Good night, sweetheart. Come on, that's enough. Oh, Luca was right. You got balls. You did good, just like he said. Now get the hell out of here. He's waiting for you over on the Bowery. Aren't you happy to see me? I've got... I've got things covered. Give my re... I've got things covered. Hey, I gotta see that new line of... It is so nice to meet someone so... Was I supposed to get beats? So 